I'm Todd Jaderborg with Odin's Wolf Survival. Today I'm going to make a candle out of a container of butter that went bad. I took some cotton cloth that was you could get from most anywhere, but bottom of a t-shirt works real well. You just twist it up real tight, and then do the opposite twist to uh, make cordage. This is going to be the wick. This is a container of butter, and you take, the easiest way to do it is pull apart the center of the cordage a little bit and set a stick in there and pull it tight so it'll want to stay. Like that, like this, and then what I do when I do this is I just force it down through the center of the butter. And then pull your stick out. There's your wick. You can do several things like that. You can run one or two in there, but we're just gonna run this one. It'll take a little bit at first as it melts the butter and gets it waking up. It'll smoke a little bit. You can do this with bacon grease, you can do Crisco, any sort of thing along that line. If you have olive oil or any standing oil, this will work also, but you'll need to make a wire stand. I'll do that on another. This will hold pretty well. If you let it go a long time, you can melt a, a big enough vat in there of melted butter that it might lay it over. But I made the wick big enough, I think it might might be okay. But in any case, this is like for temporary light, things along that line. It's burning pretty good now. The extra wick could actually be used with a flint and steel off the burnt end as an igniter to get a fire going, which I might end up going in my fire kit. But once you've got this, you have no worries about a fire. But that's in case you need to light the candle. This will provide quite a long source of heat. You'll smell the butter after a bit. It'll smell like almost burning butter, but it's nothing real major. It doesn't seem to smoke much, and it'll get a pretty good flame, but the f size of the flame depends on the size of the wick. But also, the bigger the wick you get, the faster the butter or whatever source you're using burns. But this is how I make a butter, oil, hard oil, lamp fat candle. This is Todd Jaderborg with Odin's Wolf Survival. Have a great day.